Another first for the Elegoo Centauri Carbon. And this is the first multi-print. And what I, a couple things I want you to notice here are number one, the image on the display actually shows exactly what it looked like. I took the, uh, I got the, these little tools, they're nut drivers off of printables. And I put a bunch of them on, in the slicer on the print bed and did an auto arrange and it turned them to put them very efficiently together. And then I used the Elegoo slicer instead of Orca slicer, which I have been using. And you can see the very first time that I have run multiple parts at the same time, which was dangerous on the Neptune 4 Max over here. The print bed is so large and it's not necessarily even everywhere and things would come off. So I've done no manual setup. I only did the automated setup routine when you unbox it and plug it in and it runs through all that initial setup and leveling. And it appears to be doing really well. Let's see from the side here. On these um, multiple items that are running together. Elegoo seems to have figured out some of the things that, that the bed slinger printer struggled with. This Corex Y seems to be doing very well.